I will apply some indirect current as per the program. The mountain, the block is come up. Welcome to Innovators Guru. Let's see today we are discussing about the topic design and development out of fault current limiting transformer. The objective of this work is to prove the experimental ability of transformer with variable reactors to limit the fault current and adjust the secondary voltage. The conventional power system design the transformer is the passive part of the grid but in changing future trends transformer plays an important role in controlling the power handling capacity efficiency and the reliability of it the new design specification implemented some advanced design consideration in transformer to improve the reliability and its usability current limit transformer is the one of the part of that power system this is a block diagram of the fault current limiting transformer first see the constructional details of our transformer okay our transformer is divided mainly in the three parts first one is our primary coil secondary coil and core section one another main important part is inserted in our system is moving iron block which is moved by using that stepper motor okay this transformer is constructed by using the CRNO material which is a uh, silicon steel and uh, copper winding calculation we can see in one another video here we discuss the how the, we design a single phase or three phase transformer with its in details ok let's see the second part of our uh, block diagram it's a control system ok in our controlling action we use the 230 by 12 volt 2 ampere transformer for step down voltage and after this uh, it is given to the rectifier circuitry after filtering its circuit it is regulated to 5 and 12 volt according to requirement our motor driver run on the 12 volt and our microcontroller is run on the 5 volt that's why we give the 5 volt supply to the microcontroller and uh, 12 volt supply to the motor driver circuitry our LCD is also run on the 5 volt supply okay here we use the Arduino nano microcontroller which having the core of 8 mega 38 b this is a currently open source highly reliable and popular microcontroller which which is give the ability to control our electrical systems okay for sensing and feedback purpose, we use the ACS712 Holifield based current sensor and our potential transformer which gives the 230 volt to the convert into the 6 volt and given to the microcontroller analog key. Okay. Here we use the motor driver as L298D as a stepper motor driver and our stepper motor is the NEMA 17 stepper motor to uh, control this block. Okay, you can see in live video and details about it. Okay. For the load for us, we use the 200 watt lamp as a load lamp. Let's see in our second video, we continue with us the all set working and what are the part we uses in our circuit design. Thank you.